Early this morning, Nashville and other parts of central Tennessee were hit by a tornado, resulting in at least 19 confirmed deaths and the destruction of more than 48 Buell Dings. According to Fox 7 Jennifer Waddell, the East Nashville and Germantown neighborhoods were particularly hard hit with reports trickling in of the devastating damage done to homes as well as restaurants and bars. The last two decades have seen Nashville become a travel and dining destination, with restaurants like Rolf and Daughters, Vogue, Henrietta Red, Husk, and more receiving praise at a national level. Celebrated Southern chef Ian Brock is currently building out two hotly anticipated restaurants, Joyland and Audrey, in the East Nashville area. As Eater Nashville reports, several restaurants have closed not because of damage but because of power outages or damage at had adjacent sites. The tornado seems to have cut a path along East Nashville's woodland and main treats, which run parallel to one another and are home to local music venue Basement Teast, Dessert Bar The Adopt Parlor, and popular sports bar Beyond the Edge, all of which sustained damage. Here is a list, so far of the restaurants and bars that were hit by the tornado. According to local reports and Nashville residents, including Twitter users Mentelect Brandon and Hayne Morris, the Tennessee Emergency Management Agency said in a news release that at least 22 people we re-killed in the storms. In an earlier press briefing, Tennessee Governor Bill Lee told reporters the deaths were centered in four different counties and there are a number of people that are missing in addition to many that are injured and being transported to area hospitals. The Metro Nashville Police Department said at least two people were killed in East Nashville. While a TAME official told Fox News that 16 people died in Putnam County, there were three reported deaths in Wilson County, two in Davidson County which includes that area of East Nashville, and one in Benton County, according to TAMA. Metro Nashville police officers and fire crews we're responding to about four eight building collapses around the city as neighborhoods were littered with blown down walls and roofs, snapped power lines and huge broken trees. <laughs>